Hi everyone, in front of me I've got a Realme 8i and let me share with you how to enable Google Backup on this device. So first of all we have to enter the settings and now let's scroll down to the very bottom in order to find additional settings. Now let's scroll down and here we've got the option Backup and Reset, so let's enter. Here we've got also the Google Backup section and we've got the option to add the account. If you cannot tap on it then it means that this option is turned off and as you can see you cannot do actually anything, you cannot customize this section. So remember to tap on this switcher and now let's enter the backup accounts. Make sure that you've got the internet connection because it is required. And from this step we can either create a new account if you do not have your own yet or simply type your email or phone. So let me do it and let's tap on next. Right now we have to enter the password. So let me do this out of the screen. Okay, let's tap on next. Here we've got Google Terms of Service and Privacy Policy, so of course if you want to read it, just tap on it. And here we've got all the info. Let's tap on I agree after reading. Here we've got the shortcut of backup and storage info, so just tap on accept because we will be transferred to this step, to this page. And as you can see here we've got the information about the backup, so you will be able to use 15 gigabytes of a Google account. Uh, your device will backup data automatically, will store it securely and manage your backup easily. So uh, if you want to turn on the backup, just tap on turn on. If not, you can tap on not now. and. Um, after a time, if you will want to, uh, if you want to back up the data, just tap on backup accounts and choose, of course, the account and you will be transferred to this particular step. So just tap on turn on. And actually, this is it. This is how to enable Google backup in your Realme 8i. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was helpful. And if it was, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.